part two of my BHS DVD and Blu-ray update for March 21st, 2023. So anyways, let's go and get continued. I'm going to have to watch this movie. Uh, maybe tomorrow, perhaps. Also, this is where Nana gives me, give me that and that. The two movies I'll be showing soon, so yeah. Grandma Elaine has this DVD, but I have this DVD now because I haven't seen that movie in a really long time. Because I decided I'm going to, have to get this movie a watch. Plus, that movie's from my childhood, so yeah. Anyways, back to the video. I do have this movie on Blu-ray and the sequel on Disney Plus, which the sequel is not as good as the first movie, but sequels all right. But the first movie is one of my favorites from 2007, along with No Country for Old Men and Superbad, The Simpsons Movie, and Ratatouille. Anyways, let's continue. This DVD is a former rental from Hastings. I've seen this movie Sunday. So, yeah. I'm not interested on those movies, so, yeah. I have those three movies on DVD, which is that, that, and that. I'm plan on getting this movie on VHS and... I have that movie on VHS. Me and my mom watched this movie Saturday, which is one of the best movies of 1990. Love that movie. Which that movie won the Academy Award for Best Picture of 1990. So, yeah. And here's another DVD that Nana gave me after she watched those movies because she watches movies on DVD instead of instead of streaming devices because we don't want to admit, I don't want to mention the apartment and stuff so no mentioning stuff so yeah I'm going to have to watch this movie soon.
I do need to get the sequel soon from 2013. And code if you want it. And it's a 2015 Quentin Tarantino movie. Because The Jingo Unchained, Kill Bill Volume 1 and 2, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, Pulp Fiction, and Reservoir Dogs are one of my favorite Quentin Tarantino movies of all time. So, yeah. And this DVD is a former rental from probably Hastings because of the rental stuff, the rental case, and uh, the front covered. I do need to check out this movie because I was going to get this movie on VHS, but I said get this movie on DVD. That's fine, so yeah. I'm going to have to watch this movie. Uh, tonight as well because this movie receives 100% on Rotten Tomatoes. I used to have this movie on DVD when I got this DVD for Christmas back in 2014 but not anymore. Blockbuster dates February 11th, 2003. Plus, this one of my favorite Disney movies of all time, so I decided to get this movie and rewatch this movie soon. So, yeah. Plus, I do have stitched the movie on VHS, so, yeah. And I have the sequel right here, so, yeah. Because... I did watch this sequel a long time ago, back in 2014, when we watched this movie on Netflix before replacing with Disney+. Plus. Oh, forgot to mention, I did watch Krunk's New Groove back on September 2021 on Disney+. Plus, so. Because I used to have the DVD of the sequel, but not anymore. And I do not have Leroy and Stitch, but I'll watch that movie on Disney+. Plus. So, yeah. I remember... Uh, oops. Sorry about that. I was going to get showing this DVD, but, and now time to show this movie right here. Sorry about that. My mistake. And me and my mom watched this movie Sunday afternoon after the Magnificent Seven 1960 version. MGM movie co-released by Columbia Pictures. And the case is not in a good condition, but that's all right. Uh, 
Alliance at Lands DVD because it's a Canadian copy. Canadian DVD. While in the US is is from Scream Gems. So or released by Sony, so yeah. And on the back of the DVD case showing the French ratings. And this is my first Alliance of Lands DVD. So, yeah. Oh. Showing this DVD right now. Before I show the Nanny Diaries, I'm showing this movie right here. Me and my mom got to watch this movie soon. So, oops. Showing the DVD guide. And yes, Matt Damon will be in Mystic Pizza in his acting debut when he was 18. And now I'm going to show this movie right here. And I remember renting his DVD from Redbox back in 2010. Along with Alvin Chipmunks, The Squeakle, and Tooth Fairy. Yeah, good movie right here. Need to rewatch that movie soon. Plus, Scarlett Johansson and Chris Evans was later in The Avengers and Captain America, playing Captain America and Black Widow. So, yeah. This is Melissa's favorite movie, so I decided to get that movie for the collection. This is Grandma Elaine's favorite movie of all time, so it's um can you just be quiet, Mom? Sorry about that. My mom's just talking to me. So anyways, let's go ahead and get continued. I'm gonna show you a few more DVDs first part and then part three. Um me, my brother had this DVD once. But we got rid of it because we got this DVD for Christmas. And this DVD is a film rental from Boise Public Library, which is in Boise, Idaho. I have to rewatch this movie again, so yeah. I don't have the 1968 version of this movie yet, but I will soon. Universal movie co released by Columbia Pictures. Two more DVDs for this part, and now, and then I'm done with this part. The other side's full screen, by the way. And now, here's the last DVD for this part, and that is. Right here. I have to, me and my mom could have to check out this movie tonight, so yeah. Well folks, there you have it for part, so stay tuned for part three, which is the final part.